Welcome to the Mark Brutalier Show, where we show Johns and sometimes drip. Drip or drown, baby! Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. It's Mark, Mark Brutalier, and today... I'm going to be showing you guys some items that I am bringing with me on my trip to New York. As a lot of you guys know, uh, I did discuss on social media that I am taking a trip next week. The 18th through the 25th, I will be in New York City. And so obviously I had to pack for that. And I felt like that would be a good time to kind of make a video to show you guys everything that I will be taking with me clothing wise and how to kind of a how to pack for a week long trip because obviously you want to bring items that are versatile things that you can rewear you want to have extra space in your suitcase especially when you're going to a place with great shopping um, I intend on bringing some other new items back so you got to have space for that um, as well as you know just being able to consolidate things in general and figure out new ways to rewear other items yada yada I just thought it'd be an interesting video. So, before I get ahead of myself, if you're new here, hi, welcome. Subscribe, hit the push notification bell as well, so you know when our next video is going to be. Apologies for last week, it was Mother's Day, so we did not put out a video then. I was trying to put one out midweek, it just didn't really turn out. So, we are back. No worries, no more no more waiting, we are here. But if you're uh, returning, thank you, I appreciate it. Let's get started. Firstly, I'm flying with Delta, so I have a suitcase that like I guess goes above me as well as a carry-on. Here is my carry-on item. It is just this undercover East Pack backpack. I've had this for a few years now. Kind of a meme, it's a little furry, furry backpack. It's got like the weird, I hate rose embroidery, so I don't really know like why I have this. Like, I think like it actually like brings me back to like, you know, the packs on ripped skinnies. Um, but I don't know, it's just like fluffy, it's just weird, it's ridiculous. Uh, but for whatever reason, I kind of like it. So I'll be bringing that just to kind of have on me. And yeah, I don't really know what I'm gonna keep in it yet. Like I don't even know if I'm gonna really have anything in it like going down that way. Cause you know, like I said, you wanna have extra space. So that's that. Um, and then let's get into, let's get into this ginormous suitcase. For starters. This suitcase that I'm bringing is absolute bad suitcase. <laughs> to kind of break it down, I um, am only bringing two pairs of pants. Two pairs of pants. And I do that because, for one, I feel like it's, I don't really wash a lot of my like denim anyways, um, at least not frequently. And then for two, uh, I just feel like pants are a little bit more versatile than anything else. It's kind of unsanitary in my opinion to rewear t-shirts over and over. The first pair of pants that I brought are these Helmet Lang uh, double knee like utility pants. Uh, these things, I wear them an okay amount, um, but they're kind of just like that one outfit that I believe I showed last week, the, you know, the the Purdue summer camp tee, the green jacket. Like I, I really, I go back to that outfit a lot just because it's so easy. Uh, so I brought, I brought that outfit, we got the, the t-shirt, as well as I have the STP yellow tee that I've shown before. So it's pretty much the same outfit, different t-shirt, um, to be worn twice, which I don't think is a huge issue, especially like, like I said, I'm not really like, I'm not bringing like a full different look for each day, like that would just be way more uh, space than I would want to put towards it. My apologies, that sentence that I just said there made absolutely zero sense. But uh, nevertheless, I hope you understood what I meant and um, carry on. And then of course, here's the jacket. So that kind of covers two of my outfits right there, uh, which is really great. And then to kind of make one more fit, we have the white vintage tee which obviously I'm gonna be wearing like a little like this sweatshirt over so it doesn't really matter what's on the graphic and then this uh, like sage green Marcello sweater which I think will look really well like color combination wise that's all the fits that I'm wearing with those pants and then oh sh look at that I actually I left some of my items I have the uh, 
we'll, we'll put it on the on the screen. I have my Alix Roas. That's the shoe that I'm bringing with me to pair with every one of these outfits. So, yeah, sorry about that. One pair of shoes. You know, maybe I'll get a pair of shoes there as well. That's my my thought process. Is in the event that I come back with a new pair of shoes. I forgot the I forgot the shoes at home. I also forgot the outfit that I'm wearing on the plane. So. Yeah, that is also my other pair of pants. <laughs> so the other pair of pants that I'm bringing is my like green North Face pants. Just a baggy fitting pair of pants. Kind of a like a fatigue kind of green color. Uh, just more neutral in general. And I'll be able to wear that with a lot. So my second like combination of outfits, uh, we have this Walter Van Buren knock tee, which I will be wearing like with those trousers. To go on top of that, we've got this very worn in vintage Levi's denim jacket. I feel like this jacket is one of those things that it has such a worn in look anyways. I feel like it's something you can wear like every single day and it's not really weird because it like it just looks like an everyday thing. So, and it, it's just a light layer as well because from what I know, the temperatures there are supposed to be pretty like neutral. So you want to kind of have like bring layers but also like things that you can like easily like take on and off in the event that you get too hot or too cold at any given time to have another t-shirt to go with that same fit we have just this SLP tee with like kind of the wide neck very like vintagey looking t-shirt so easy does it very nice very nice pretty much the same outfit twice um, and then another outfit to wear with those pants, something that kind of gives a little more versatility. We have just this white t-shirt. There is a graphic, but I'm gonna be wearing something over it, so it does not matter. Beams! Sweater vest right here. So we'll be, we'll be a sweater vest boy for one day, um, which I think is also great, because if I want to wear that denim jacket over this, it would still layer really great. Um, my other outfit that I had to wear on the plane, just to kind of Describe it out to you since I don't have it in my possession right now Those North Face pants White t-shirt and then my Marc Jacobs stray rats little zip up to wear you know, you know just some cozy cozy vibes for the airport for the first day and then of course those Roas so hopefully the Roas will you know stand the the ultimate test of seven days straight wearing them I'm probably gonna be super like, I'm probably gonna hate those shoes as well as both of these pairs of pants by the time I get back just from wearing them so much, but uh, you know, it happens. Hopefully we'll come back with some great items. Stay tuned for next week as well, um, or I say next week, it could be like a couple weeks from now. When I do get back, I'm probably gonna have footage from New York as well as some of my pickups from there, so. Be ready for that one as well. So this is everything I'm gonna bring with me. Um, I do have some accessories as well. I got this tote bag. You know, we love an empty tote, but also when I'm shopping around all day or what have you, it'll be nice to kind of have something to like bring with me in the event that I get something as opposed to like carrying around a million shopping bags. Um, as well as I have this shoulder bag for the denim jacket fits that I'm wearing um, it's just like it, it's a nice little thing to just kind of like throw over not that I really put that much in this either but um, yeah it'll be nice to kind of have an accessory it kind of helps build what otherwise would be a pretty basic outfit but um, that's pretty much everything that I'm bringing I got uh, some socks as well you know and I haven't yet put my my underoos in there as well as like some other stuff but that's everything clothing wise that I am bringing that I didn't forget to, you know, other, other than the stuff that I forgot. My bad. If you enjoyed this content, leave a comment. Uh, if you have any New York City suggestions, of course you can drop those in the comments or DM me on Instagram at Mark underscore Boudelier. I've gotten some great suggestions from some of you guys already, but uh, of course if you have any more or any sort of cool fun things that are going down any sample sales because your boys trying to kind of find some of those that'd be cool so again thank you guys so much for watching i really appreciate it sorry this video was a little bit all over the place but i hope this kind of helps better prepare for when you have to pack for multiple days thank you guys for watching 
See you guys next week. Bye. Elise Shane. Yeah, Elise Shane. Stupid, stupid, stupid. <laughs>